Is it on? Good. Oh, I'm a bit close. Hang on. Much better. Fat loss. We see marketing every single day talking about fat loss. Like, yeah, you're gonna lose 10 pounds in two weeks. Cool, and? You're gonna feel great. You're gonna be so awesome. You're gonna look good naked. And? There are some things we have on fat loss that we don't even think about. Here are 32 things, 32 things, that are unexpected benefits of you Drop in the chub. You poop less. That means when you go to the toilet, it's cool. You've got more stuff to scroll through on Twitter, on Facebook, on Instagram. You're not just looking at the same things over and over again. Also, you spend less on toilet roll. And when you go out to London and you go out to these big public places that are too tight to even let you lose the toilet for free, you save money there too. On that note, you fart less. That means when you're on your first date, you haven't got to worry about having that food and then stinking things out, you spend less money on air freshener, and it's kind of cool because you smell brilliant. However, you don't really smell like roses, so that might be a bit of a negative. Acne gets better. Yeah, you stop looking like a 13 year old teenager that has just reached puberty with all that greasy skin and has just got his first job at McDonald's. I might be talking from uh, self experience there. Yeah, probably. You have a better attitude towards food. You don't have to eat it all. You don't feel like it's a connection where you're pulling you towards that, that bug on bug's life stay away from the light i can't help it it's so beautiful better relationship with food mentally you feel clearer less brain fog more work gets done you can really decide on how you want to own and boss your life without having to reach for the big mac or crispy creams own that shit you procrastinate less. You get shit done. You actually do the work. You actually go and take the dogs for a walk. You actually do the washing up. You actually go and pick the shit up on the grass. You actually cut the grass. You actually clean the windows. You actually do the washing. You know, all the real things people don't talk about rather than actually writing that blog, actually making that video, actually writing that copy. You get more done, less time, and less procrastination. Your skin. Skin. Skin is much better. It's much better. A little bit of moisturizer every day, a good routine. Your skin gets better. When you sweat, and you get those sweaty armpits, you get that sweaty chest, you get that sweat patch on your back, you may still sweat a little bit, but you sweat less, and your sweat does not stink as much. Trust me. I've seen both sides of the spectrum here. Be the dude that sweats but doesn't stink. Not the stinky dude that sweats ridiculously. Your dick looks bigger. Have to believe me on that one. You wanna exercise the demon a lot more. Your sex drive grows up. That's always a good thing. Provided there's someone there to have sex with, right? Traveling? Traveling is easier. Getting on that bus, getting on that train, getting on that plane where they have the narrowest ever seats, the smallest legroom, and before you know it, the person next to you is literally reaching over. No, don't be that dude that takes up free seats. Traveling is easier. You fit into clothes better. You look good. They start fitting on your arms nicely, your shoulders nicely. You don't have to buy a double XL just to fit into your clothes. Your car is cleaner due to less snacking. You tolerate the heat so much better, which is not a problem here in the UK, really. You get less headaches. That 
brain starts feeling good and starts feeling like it's smashing against your skull and you just feel amazing because your head is not hurting enough. Usually the headache is over which flavor McFlurry you're gonna be choosing, but anyway, that's another story. Your confidence is up like a boss. You just feel like your chest is out, your back is straight. You wanna just bust a bicep shot every single day because you feel like the fucking man. You can fit on swings with your kids. You can take them to the park, you can put them on your lap, and you can swing with them. Yes, that actually helps in this life we call the real world. Your boobs get smaller. Your shorts don't ride up your legs every time you go for a walk. You get taller because your posture is so much better and that confidence is giving you a couple of extra inches. Bousy. You no longer have that back pain. You no longer suffer from it and you can't even get up out of bed because your muscles are actually working like they're designed to do. Support your body. No acid reflux or heartburn or anything like that. Because your digestion is living the life. You can tie your shoes so much better without reaching down and your gut getting in the way, getting out of breath, having to put your leg up and you can't even do it, you can't balance on one leg. You can get your shoes on like a functioning adult. Your asthma is better. You're no longer having to always rely on your inhaler when you walk to the drive just to get the mail, just to get the paper, when you walk to the store just to go and get your morning fix of sugary drinks. Your asthma is buggered off. You can walk for longer without ever needing a break. You've got that endurance up. You don't get that lower back pump. You don't feel out of breath and tired. It's kind of cool. You got no stains on your clothes because you're no longer having those really bad greasy foods all the time and dripping all that ketchupy, mustardy, flavouring, fake cheese, juicy sauce down your top. It's probably on your shoes instead because your gut's not in the way. You just love yourself more. You're the fucking boss. This one used to get me. You're not the odd one out anymore. You don't stick out like a sore thumb. You're actually part of the crowd. It's kind of cool. You sleep better. You're no longer having your weight wake yourself up like you've got sleep apnea. You actually sleep better and your stress is lowered. So you stop waking up through the night. You feel good. You feel refreshed. You don't get that Monday morning feeling again. No more knee pain. No more saying, I can't squat because i got bad knees. I can't run because i got bad knees. I can't walk because i got bad knees. I can't use the stairs because I've got bad knees. Your knees feel good. There's less pressure, less weight going for them. You get more attention from the opposite sex. All the same sex, depending on what you're into, that feels good. Even if it is for your ego, right? And your chairs are comfier. I know why I finished on that last one. It's a little bit like the travel thing and the stairs one and the uh, going on the swings one, but hey, that's the list I wrote, that's the last one on there, the chairs are comfier. 32 reasons that you really should drop that fat. Benefits you don't even think of. Alongside, yeah, you're gonna have more energy, you're gonna look good naked, you're gonna just feel great. Let's look at the real life, let's look at the real reasons, let's look at the real world. Speak to you soon.